Actuators Actuators are devices used to produce action or motion. It is operated by a source, mainly electrical signal, air, and fluids, that converts the energy into motion. Actuator's output is usually mechanical, that is linear displacement, or velocity. Actuation can be from few microns to few meters. The common example of actuator is forward and backward movement of car seat with the help of actuator. For the right working of actuators, it follows some functional flow, which is called as actuator functional diagram. Here, an energy source provides the necessary power to the amplifier in the actuator to convert the low power control signal into a high power signal and transducer converts the energy of the amplified signal into work. Actuators are of two types. Hydraulic actuators and pneumatic actuators. Hydraulic actuators. It consists of a hydraulic cylinder and a motor that uses hydraulic power to facilitate mechanical operation. These mechanical motions are delivered as linear displacement, rotary motion or reciprocating motion. Pump, driven by a prime mover, that is, electric motor, creates flow of fluid. For clear understanding, we can look at the working of a hydraulic forklift. Here, the pump pushes the hydraulic fluid into the lines. The lines carry the fluid to actuators, which are pushed to cause a mechanical output to move a load. Here, this push causes a linear motion in the cylinders. Hydraulic actuator are of two types. Linear hydraulic actuators. Rotary hydraulic actuators. Pneumatic actuators. The actuators that are designed to operate on compressible fluid, generally air, is known as pneumatic actuator. The pneumatic actuators use the pressurized air as input and change it into mechanical motion. More specifically, Pneumatic actuators are devices that change the pressure obtained by compressing the air into mechanical energy. Pneumatic actuators enable considerable forces to be produced from relatively small pressure changes. To know more, sign up to www.linksy.in.